I ask you to stand as we sing the baptismal hymn and for the children to come up front. Okay, the congregation may sit, and the baptismal party will remain standing, and I think here they come. Children can come and sit right around here, anywhere right here, that's good, over here, right there. Just be careful of this right there, okay? Is that it? Good. Are there any more children coming over? Yes. Okay. <laughs> okay, I think this is it. Is the baptismal party ready? The candidate for holy baptism will now be presented. I present Miles Camberlin Bonner to receive the sacrament of baptism. Will you be responsible for seeing that the child you present is brought up in the Christian faith and life? I will with God's help. Will you by your prayers and witness help this child to grow into the full stature of Christ? I will do you renounce Satan and all the spiritual forces of wickedness that rebel against God? I renounce them. Do you renounce the evil powers of this world which corrupt and destroy the creatures of God? I renounce them. Do you renounce all sinful desires that draw you from the love of God? I renounce them. Do you turn to Jesus Christ and accept him as your Savior? I do. Do you put your whole trust in his grace and love? I do. 
Do you promise to follow and obey him as your Lord? I do. Will you who witness these vows do all in your power to support these persons in their life in Christ? We will. Let us join with him who is committing himself to Christ and renew our own baptismal covenant. Do you believe in God the Father? Do you believe in Jesus Christ, the Son of God? I believe in Jesus Christ, His only Son, our Lord. He was conceived by the power of the Holy Spirit and born of the Virgin Mary. He suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and buried. He descended into the dead. On the third day, He rose again. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of the Father. He will come again to the just, the living, and the dead. Do you believe in God, the Holy Spirit? I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and the life everlasting. Here are the questions I was talking about earlier. They're serious. Will you continue in the apostles' teaching and fellowship, in the breaking of the bread, and in the prayers? I will, God's help. Will you persevere in resisting evil, and whenever you fall into sin, repent and return to the Lord? I will, God's help. Will you proclaim by word and example the good news of God in Christ? I will. Will you seek and serve Christ in all persons, loving your neighbor as yourself? I will, God's help. Will you strive for justice and peace among all people and respect the dignity of every human being? I will, God's help. Let us now pray for this child who is to receive the sacrament of new birth. Deliver him, O Lord, from the way of sin and death. Lord, hear our prayer. Open his heart to your grace and truth. Lord, hear our prayer. Fill him with your holy and life-giving spirit. Lord, hear our prayer. Keep him in the faith and communion of your holy church. Lord, hear our prayer. Teach him to love others in the power of the spirit. Lord, Send him into the world in witness to your love. Lord, Bring him to the fullness of your peace and glory. Lord, Grant, O Lord, that all who are baptized into the death of Jesus Christ, your Son, may live in the power of his resurrection and look for him to come again in glory who lives and reigns now and forever. Amen. Amen. The baptismal party, please come forward. The Lord be with you. And also with you. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right to give thanks and praise. We thank you, Almighty God, for the gift of water. Over it, the Holy Spirit moved in the beginning of creation. Through it, you led the children of Israel out of their bondage in Egypt into the land of promise. In it, your son Jesus received the baptism of John and was anointed by the Holy Spirit as the Messiah the Christ, to lead us through his death and resurrection from the bondage of sin into everlasting life. Miles, I baptize you in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Hey.
miles. You are sealed by the Holy Spirit and marked as Christ's own forever. Amen. Can you find it? Oops. Oops. Thank you. Miles. <coughs> Receive the light of Christ. Amen. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, we thank you that by water and the Holy Spirit you bestowed upon this your servant the forgiveness of sin and have raised him to the new life of grace. Sustain him, O Lord, in your Holy Spirit. Give him an inquiring and discerning heart. The courage to will and to persevere, a spirit to know and to love you, and the gift of joy and wonder in all your works. Amen. Amen. Let us welcome the newly baptized. We receive you, household of God. Confess the faith of Christ crucified. Proclaim his resurrection and share with us in his eternal priesthood. Well, we've got to do the red carpet walk. You see Miles? Hi, Miles. Hey, Miles. Look at all these people. Hey. See all these people? Yeah. So why don't you all stand? The peace of Christ be always with you. And also with you. Amen. He's loving it. Hello there. Hi, Miles. Miles, this is this dressing. Hey there. <laughs> yes. Yes. <laughs> there you go. Miles is loving it. Hey there. Hey. <laughs> and you get a shot too. <laughs> oh me. <laughs> Peace on you. There you go. There you go. Yeah.